this is the second time uh, mayor at your summer safety yeah. thing. You specifically mentioned judges, yep. and now Councilman McCormick, you're mentioning judges yep. again. I'm, wh where is this coming from? Is well, this it, 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 it's a major problem. Yep. Um, I can count on many hands how many instances where we've had judges be too loose and allow repeat offenders back on our streets. And I've had a conversation with the prosecutor about this. I'm going to be talking to some judges about this over the next couple of weeks. But we need real judicial accountability to keep our streets safe and secure. Chief Drummond and Commander Tucker can be as aggressive as they can to put criminals in jail. But when those judges release them on our streets, it makes their job even harder. And that's frankly unacceptable. And so we want to make sure we're being aggressive on our, on our part in law enforcement. But we need our judges and our prosecutors to work with local law enforcement. And this is happening not just in Cleveland. It's happening in New York. It's happening in San Francisco. It's happening all across this co the country. Judges have a role to play to keep our streets safe. And they must step up. They must step up. I just want to support what the mayor said, and, and I'll give you a story. Um, I had a nurse who was pretty violently um, assaulted in downtown Cleveland. Um, Cleveland Police did an incredible job um, navigating that case. And you can imagine how blown away my residents were when they saw the individual on the street the next day. It, and I'm, we're not talking about mental health. We're talking about someone who committed a felony, a violent a felony, and the judges had them back on the street the next day. That is unacceptable. 